I don't watch all the animated movies and stuff, but I am a big fan of the Toy Story trilogy. My name is Woody. This is my spot. Ah! I am Buzz Lightyear. So Quentin Tarantino was recently on Bill Maher's Club Random podcast, and they get into the talk about the Toy Story series, which Bill Maher has not only not seen, but doesn't know what it is somehow. That that- I'm agnostic, never saw it. Yeah. Where's the rock you sleep under? I think there's only one trilogy that completely and utterly works to the- nth degree. And Quentin Tarantino gets into the fact that trilogy movies end up with movies that aren't on par with one another, one being better than the other. And, and that's a uh, uh, fistful of dollars for a few dollars more and the good and the bad and the ugly. That's a trilogy? Yeah. So yeah. Well, oh, they, those are uh, all the same character. Yeah. It's yeah. The, the man with no name. The man with no name. Yeah. Right. Clint Eastwood. Yeah. And he goes into the Spaghetti Western trilogy, specifically Clint Eastwood's Dollars trilogy. It's one director vision, Sergio Leone, through all three so movies. So that's the Spaghetti Western. Yes. You'll see this big jump from the first right. to the second, and they don't really land the third one. But in the case of so this Toy Story. But then he goes into the third being like the best. The third one is, is just magnificent. It's one of the best movies I've ever seen. Looking good. Good work, fellas. Whoa, hey. And if you've seen the other two, then it's just, it's devastating. Is it a cartoon? Yeah, well, it's a, yeah, it's a, yeah, it's a cartoon. Where the story kind of concludes, you know? Andy's going to college, donating his toys to Bonnie. That really concluding the connection between Andy and his toys, he has now grown up. The Potato Heads, Mr. and Mrs. You gotta keep them together because they're madly in love. They mean a lot to me. It seems like the series has nowhere to go. Three years later or something, they did a fourth, and I have no desire to see it. Right. Everyone, Bonnie made a friend in class. A, oh, she's course. already making friends. No, no, she literally made a new friend. I want you to meet Forky. Uh, hi. Ah! <gasps> you literally ended the story as perfect as you could. So, no, I I don't care if it's good. Toy Story 4 just basically creating a new storyline, kind of similar to the other series, but just in the hands of Bonnie now instead of Andy. I'm done. Why put the- I am done. I, it can still be good, but I'm done. And yeah, Toy Story 4 was still a pretty good movie. I wouldn't say it's as good as Toy Story 3, but it was still decent. I can understand where he's coming from. Like you start to oversaturate the movie market and a certain franchise. And it starts to taint like the legacy of what a movie is. And it just spreads too thin, you know? And Quentin Tarantino really wanting nothing to do with it. I don't want to see the fourth. I've seen the third. They concluded it. We're good. And then Bill Maher making this really gross don't put the condom on after you come. <laughs> yeah. Condom analogy. I mean, if you follow that rule of life. <laughs> then Bill Maher goes on to make a joke about how there's only two Kill Bills made by Quentin Tarantino, which follows his trilogy philosophy. So this is why there's no Kill Bill 3. Yeah. <laughs> this, yes. Right? Yeah. Because you feel no, like... No, I did. I killed Bill. <laughs> right. <laughs> which he's not wrong. Beatrix kills Bill at the end of Kill Bill 2 with the uh, five-point palm heart exploding technique. And I mean, the Kill Bill movies are incredible. They're like some of my favorite films of all time. And I can only imagine how the series could go downhill if Quentin Tarantino started making Kill Bill 3, 4, 5, 6. So, I mean, he kind of has me on this argument. I can't disagree, but you know, that's up for argument. Some people might disagree, which is totally fine. Let me know what you guys think about Quentin Tarantino's statement in those comments below. Thank you guys so much for watching. And you guys know the drill. Ta-ta for now. Really?